What do you like best about this victory? Uh, our defense intensity. I feel like uh, you know this could be a game you know where we could take it lightly or take plays off, and you know we had kind of some slippage. Uh, in the first half, and so we addressed those things here in halftime and uh, made sure we came out in the second half, you know, with more intensity and turned them over, make sure that we were careful with the ball because we had a few turnovers ourselves and just make sure we executed it the right way. I think we're more um, engaged. I feel like when we're making shots, you know, sometimes you can find, find yourself get frustrated and sometimes your offense can carry over into your defense intensity, but I feel like us coming out uh, strong really helped us out to get out to a big lead and uh, like I said, we addressed our, our mistakes and you know got the lead back up and everybody got to play tonight. And we just knew that regardless of them not having you know the type of players or their starters, we knew that I mean still NBA players. We know that they're all still capable of you know making an impact on the game. And if we gave them any daylight or we gave them any confidence, we knew that they can come out and you know give us a game. So that was one thing that we really talked about before the game to make sure that you know we just took the confidence and hit them hard when we first came out. We just trying to get as many wins as we can for the rest of the season. We really haven't talked as a team where we want to finish, but uh, I feel like our main thing is just making the playoffs, really. It's different. Uh, obviously, they have a lot of guys sitting out tonight for various reasons, but you know, there's a lot of NBA players in this league that are very capable of playing at a high level, so I'm sure a lot of those guys on, on Sacramento were relishing the opportunity to perform, and they played hard. You know, we just try to come out and protect home court. You know, it just depends on their situation, depends on their role, and what's being asked of them, but when you see a team sit out three or four starters, you know other guys are going to be aggressive. You, you never know what kind of plays they're going to run because the, the entire offense changes once Cousins goes out the game, once there's no Rondo, once there's no Rudy Gay. So there's less isolations, more picking rolls, uh, more fast break opportunities.